guys, you join me back with friends of Paul and his Vauxhall Viva and it's on the road now so he's got these nice new number plates on it. Nicely done. And today, well, Paul's been on about asking me to come and help him do some soundproofing to his car, which he's already done soundproofing down below in the bulkhead here, which you can't really see much. But he's going to continue the soundproofing back here, so I'm going to pass you over to him. Right, so I've done the bottom half, but the dashboard's in the way, so I've got to get this bulkhead cover off, put some sound deadening in there, and it makes a massive difference on these old cars. I've done it before in 1988, and I'm doing it again. First half sounds a lot better, I just need to do this bit, and it'll be completely silent when it's on tick over. All old cars could benefit from this being done, because people don't realise that they simply didn't bother to do it in the 70s like a lot of things. So anyway, let's get on with it. Let's get the soundproofing fitted.
Well then, there we are. Soundproofing done to Paul's Viva. And as a bonus, Paul's let me drive it. So, uh, what do you think of that then, Paul? Yeah, it's definitely a lot quieter now. It's much better. Yeah. Well, it's something this area. you recommend doing to a lot of classics, don't you? You know, because obviously, back in the day, it's something they never used to do. So this is a bit strange to me, obviously driving a left-hand drive car in a right-hand drive country. In actual fact, I've never driven a car that's left-hand drive, so it's a first. And I'm amazed that Paul's let me do it. But uh, don't crash. Don't crash. <laughs> so anyway, we hope that video has helped out some of you guys with the classic cars. You know, where do you get the insulation from there, Paul? Just got it from the local scrapyard. They gave me it for nothing. Well, that's, that's that's pretty good, there, isn't it? Yeah. It's you know, expensive on eBay. Yeah. Yeah, you know, it's cheaper to obviously just get it down the scrapyard than buy dial dynamite there, is it? Dynamat? Yeah, dynamat. It's yeah. very expensive. Yeah, I mean, it does do exactly the same job and it's cost you virtually peanuts. So, and you know, the difference, obviously, it's there's no bangs, better. there's yeah. no rattles from the car. Quiet. So, yeah, brilliant, absolutely brilliant. So, anyway, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Yeah, Take care, folks.